This shooting changed Australia forever. The death toll continues to rise at Port Arthur, where a gunman today went on a random shooting spree. In 1996, Australian national Martin Bryant killed 35 people in and around a cafe. He used an AR-15 and an L1A1 rifle, both rapid-fire semi-automatic weapons. The shooting was the world's worst single-person mass shooting at the time. Australia made substantial changes to its gun laws after the Port Arthur massacre by banning semi-automatic and self-loading guns. The national buyback of guns is expected to cost every Australian taxpayer up to $50. The government also bought back almost one million guns and destroyed all of them. There were 11 mass shootings in the decade before 1996. After the ban, only two family murder-suicide incidents have been reported. Like Australia, New Zealand has also banned semi-automatic and automatic firearms after the recent terror attack on two mosques in Christchurch. So, will more countries take heed and follow suit?